Hello and welcome back to Free to Play Friday. This week we'll be, we will be talking about Tetris 99. And to help me, I have somebody here who's played it a lot more than I have, my good friend Max. Hello. Um, so, uh, basic description of Tetris 99. Tetris Battle Royale, basically. That is an asterisk description of the game. Would you agree? Yeah, that seems about right. Um, so, it is pretty much Tetris. All in all, you even have the lines, which can get really annoying, because when there's 99 players and yourself, you'll, you will quite often uh, be finding that you'll have multiple people sending your lines, making it harder and harder to not just get killed by lines instantly. And, that, and we have both had it multiple times where um, we've just gotten lines from somebody and died. Yeah, and it, the, the, the problem usually arises even like right at the beginning where some you have like, you end up having like five or six people sending you lines straight at the beginning and you just instantly die. Yeah, yeah, we we have both had it where we died at like 94 in 94th place um, because of that. Um, so yeah, and there are obviously some crazy good Tetris players like. If you played Tetris in the arcades or just loved any Tetris game that came after it, because this is literally the best selling game of all time, outselling Wii Sports on the Wii, which was our, which was packaged with uh, one of the best selling consoles of all time. Well, to be fair, uh, Tetris has been remade like a hundred times. Time. I've been done countless times, so of course it's going to sell more than Wii Sports. Yeah, which has only released once on the Wii. Anyway, I don't really mind a port of it. That wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I mean, it was basically a temp demo, which 1 2 Switch should have been uh, uh, packaged with the Switch when it, when it first released, but overall, um, it was still a legit, legitimately fun game. I even did a free to play Friday on it. It was that fun. Um, hey. But, um, Tetris, yeah, there is a reason why it is the best selling game of all time. It is just fun and it's, uh, um, very addicting. Yeah. Um, on for, like, um, with a second, I would suggest getting, if the developers, for some reason, um, somehow the developers are watching this video, like, for some reason, people just like to decide they want to share the shit out of this on like YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, on every like social media out there, and somehow the developers of this game um, stumble upon this, uh, and they live listening somehow, despite the astronomically astronomic odds. Um, in more in the in the 99 player version, just lose the stacks and uh, make a one-on-one uh, -on -one version where you can even invite a, pl pl a friend with, uh, um, from your friends list to uh, go up against you and have stacks there because stacks in 99 mode they just aren't fun. Well, it's not that they're not fun they just can they can just get they can just kill you instantly very... if you're unlucky. Well yeah. And, it, and that pretty much takes all of the skill out of it. Like, sure, if it in one v one I can uh, keep up with, uh, I could probably keep up with. Well, I probably can't keep up with Max, as he's probably better at the game than me. But I could probably keep up with Max and not just instantly die five seconds into the game. Well, yeah, that's true. I mean, even then, like, even though I'm pretty okay at the game, even I'm getting like instant KO'd right at the start of the game, and I'm pretty good at the game. So, yeah, so. Um, remove the uh, um, stacking from the 99 player mode and uh, implement it to a 1v1 mode with stacks in it. Um, maybe even then have a switch for stacks on and stacks off just in case. Um, you know, if you want a quick game, stacks on. If you want a um, longer game, stacks off. Um, but yeah, it is genuinely a fun game and uh, it did not. And while we're calling the footage for this, Unlike Fortnite, where I felt every second of uh, recording time, in this, I didn't. I just 
didn't even realize that we had almost been recording for half an hour. Um, I had recorded footage for half an hour, and then I was like, oh, that was, that was really fun. I did not re re you know, I just genuinely did not realize I had recorded for that, for that period, period of time. You may not see it that entire period of time, because I'll probably just edit it down to um, the, vi the video's length. Um, but, yeah. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say about it. Genuinely fun. Um, now, there was a data mine of it. Um, where, let me just get this up here. Um, wrong one. Uh, go to Facebook, yeah. Um, new game mode, according to a data mine, new game modes will be added to Tetris 99 in an update. Um, team battle, two uh, giant team clashes uh, be on the, the winning side. Um, so yeah, that, that sounds like fun. 50 versus 50 or something like that would be fun. Yeah, that does sound like an interesting option. Yeah, or... And then... Yeah, what, what was I saying? Or even if it's like... 25 by 25 by 25 by 25. Yeah, all that. Um, and then there's Com Battle, which honestly I was surprised it's not in the base game. Yeah. So Same Battle here. against 98 bots defeated to the machines that support both the 99 Battle and Team Battle. And then, then there's Marathon, Score Attack, 200 lines, or Endless, which I would love an Endless mode, to be honest. That's just basically normal Tetris, though. Yeah, that well, it is Tetris. A good game. It was always endless mode, so you know, just try and get a high score. Yeah, you know, just like go on to endless mode and uh, the practice bit. Yeah. Well, I'll probably be. I, I I may use endless a bit if when it comes out, but I would probably I will probably spend more of my time on combat. Or yeah, computer battle. Yeah, that, that, all, that would also be a good way to practice, but um, for me, I'd probably spend most of my time practicing in endless mode because um, my main problem when I'm playing is that I'm not bad against players, I just panic. And that the endless mode would probably help me um, be more secure in, um, you know, just like, okay, I'm going to place this here and I know this is the right thing to do. Because I've done it yeah. a billion times before. On the endless mode because I. Are there going to be any lines coming anywhere? Yeah. Um, and it, it and it basically makes and then that also means that you don't have the stress of having to compete with other players or bots or something uh, um, as well. Hmm. But um, I would bet money on the, the statement I'm about to say right here. Tetris 99 might be the next big thing in live streaming on Twitch or YouTube. And uh, um, if I'm wrong, I would be very, very, very surprised. Like, um, it has all of the... Um, it has all of the good things about uh, Fortnite that people like. Um, but it's not as long as a Fortnite game, so you know, you in the Tetris, uh, in one of these, you'll put here, it'll only take a few minutes uh, to uh, finish a game, and then even uh, shorter to just jump into another uh, match. So, yeah, it's just, uh, I could legitimately see this being, and it's also retro from 8, is it it's Tetris an 80s game or something? Uh, yeah, yeah, it was originally released on the NES in the 80s. Yeah, and in arcades. Um, an arcade game? I can't remember. Yeah, I'm 99% sure it was an arcade game because it was a SNES game. Anyway, um, people who played it back then in the 80s um, would be good at this. And um, 80s is really big right now. Like, if you're... Um, trying to get your channel noticed on like YouTube or Twitch, just try to live streaming this because I would bet my bottom pound that this game would uh, will do at least decently well in live streaming because 80s is quite big right now. 80s nostalgia, 80s collectibles, just 80s like ukulele. Um, while that's not 80s, that's 90s, which is very close. 
um, because it's based Kuri. off um, Banjo Kazooie, and heck, you could even say it was uh, somewhat based off the 80s with collector fonts from there, like Mario, which was kind of a collector font because you collected coins and power ups. I guess. And it was still collector fonts back then, so 80s is still quite big, and somewhat 90s, but to a lesser extent. I mean, there was a there was but there was the Bohemian Rhapsody movie. Like, if um, that... 70s. Yeah. 70s. Yeah, that song came out in the 70s. Alright. 70s. So what? What sort? What else came? Out? Well, what did come out in the 80s then? Well, SNES. SNES classic. I mean, the SNES classic sold like hot potatoes. I don't mean just hot potatoes, I mean like potatoes that were magically infused with fire en elemental to be literally fire potatoes. The SNES came out in 1990. 1990. So then the yes. NES came out in the 80s. Yes. Okay, so NES was... And the, well, the NES just sold just as well. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, so those two did sell really well, so... There is a lot of stuff on the 80s which is coming, is making a return, especially the music. Like, when you have the music that, that's around today and then you just compare it to like, music from the 70s and 80s, it's like, no comparison. Like, um, Justin Bieber to Michael Jackson. Exactly. Or Queen to um, Nicki Minaj. Oh god, I wouldn't even want to make that comparison. Uh, um, but yeah, a lot of old and nostalgic stuff like Tetris and stuff from the 80s and 70s and Teresa and 90s. They are making a big comeback, so I wouldn't surprise if Tetris uh, 99 became the next big thing, like I said. And they, uh, don't be surprised if you see me and Max live gaming it together. Yep. Um, because we did legitimately have a good, a bit, good bit of fun and just like laughing at each other, just like dying from getting stacked. Like, well, it's not fun to get stacked, it is funny to uh, watch people get stacked. Now, uh, the, the thing about streaming this is, uh, with the stacking, is you're probably going to get stream stacked. Mm. It's like everyone's like, oh, that's a, that's a streamer. I'm going to pull my stacks on him. <laughs> well, you, I guess that's just three views for your um, live stream then. Uh, you stacked me, but I'm getting views on my uh, stream, which is getting my channel more promotion. So I really don't care. <laughs> um, I, can, I can imagine it now, you just like go into a lobby if you're like a really popular streamer on this. And it's like all oh, the entire screen is just like full of yellow lines. Mm. Oh, that would be hilarious. Anyway, um, I think that's where we're going to end this video off here. Otherwise, we're just going to start rambling and stuff. Do you have anything you want to say, Max? Not really. Everything I've wanted to say has pretty much been said already. Yeah. Because there really, there really isn't that much to say about this. It is Tetris for Battle Royale like. So, yeah. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Bye. And remember, kill all dolphins.